Hey YouTube, this is Drew Adam Tech here to show you how to convert Ubuntu to Pop! OS. So let's say you really want that Pop! OS look and feel, but you want to dual boot your OS with Windows, and you don't want to go through the process of manually setting up your partitions. Or you already have Ubuntu installed, and you don't want to install a whole new OS, but you really love that Pop! OS look and feel. So if that's the case, you came to the right place. And the thing is, if you really want that look and feel of another Ubuntu-based distro, and you're using vanilla Ubuntu, you probably don't need to install a whole new OS. There's probably a package for Ubuntu that allow you to convert your existing Ubuntu installation to that Ubuntu-based distro. Just one thing, just like with upgrading your Ubuntu release, there's no way back after you do this without doing a full reinstallation. But without further ado, let's get right into it. So what you're gonna wanna do is open up terminal, type, sudo, by the way I have all these commands in the description, apt install session installer, exactly like that, no spaces on session installer, enter, put in your password, then hit y, then what you're going to want to do is type sudo add apt repository ppa colon system76 slash pop, and then hit enter, then hit enter again, then type sudo apt dash get install pop dash desktop, then hit enter, then hit Y, then hit enter. Now I'll start the conversion process to pop OS. So now this will take a while, so I'll speed this up. All right, now that once that command is done, you're gonna close out a terminal, then you're gonna go ahead and reboot your system. All right, so now first thing you'll notice, your login screen is now pop OS. All right, so now the theme looks a lot like Ubuntu except for the wallpaper. That's because everything is converted over to Pop! OS except for the theme. Now you can see that you even got the Pop Shop. So now what you're gonna wanna do is install GNOME Tweaks if you haven't already, and then punch in your password. All right, so now once that's installed, you're gonna close out of the Pop Shop, then you're gonna open up Tweaks. All right, so then under Appearance Themes Applications, you're gonna change it to Pop. Pop Dark is Pop! OS's dark theme. But for the purposes of this video, we're just going to go with the pop theme. And cursor, change it to pop. Icons, change it to pop. There we go. And then to mimic Pop! OS's behavior, you can turn both of these off. Extensions, again to mimic Pop! OS's default behavior, just turn all of these on. And then you can change whatever you want here. There you go. So then you're going to go to the settings, dock. This is to mimic Pop! OS's default behavior of maximizing screen real estate. And you're going to turn on auto hide the dock. There you go. Unfortunately, it comes back. You have nothing open, but whatever. We're going to ignore that. Yeah, like it's not 100% like Pop! OS, but it's very, very close. But anyway, we're going to install all these updates. Now this will take a while, so I'll speed this up. Okay, and then if this pops up, you're going to click install the package maintainers version. All right, so now once everything's up to date, you're gonna close out of the pop shop and then you're gonna reboot. All right, so now once you've done that, you should notice that that pop OS look and feel is complete aside from this dock, which I don't know how to get rid of. If you do know how to get rid of it, please let me know down in the comments. But anyway, that is how you convert Ubuntu to pop OS. So thanks for watching. If you liked this video, found it was helpful, hit the like button, share this video with your friends, subscribe to the channel, and leave a comment.